Hello everyone, welcome back. Today I'm going to be interviewing Jan, Antonia, and Rizard Zabinski about their actions during the Holocaust. For those of you that don't know much about the Zabinskis, they saved hundreds of people from being killed during the Holocaust by hiding them from the Nazis. Jan and Antonia, were both of you born in Warsaw, Germany? No, I was born in St. Petersburg, Russia. Yes, I was born in Warsaw, Germany. Jan, why and when did you become a zookeeper? Well, when I was a child, my parents always taught me to love animals. So whenever I co-founded a zoo, after I got my doctoral degree in zoology. What made both of you decide to start saving people? We saw so many of our friends in need, and we wanted to help. We had the ability to help, and we weren't just going to stand by and watch them suffer and lose loved ones. Jan, I heard that you were captured during the Warsaw Polish Uprising. What is it? What was it like for you personally? Oh yes, it was terrible. They treated prisoners worse than animals were treated. We were being worked to death daily. I was terrified of never seeing my wife and son again. I'm just thankful that I survived, and and that my family didn't have to go through it as well. So. How did you start saving people? Oh, we hit people in our house, and when the Germans launched an assault on Warsaw, a lot of animal enclosures were emptied. Since Jan was a zookeeper, we utilized the clean cages and stalks in the zoo to hide people. Was your son Rizard helpful? Yes, he was very helpful. I looked after them and nourish them. How are you able to afford the costs? First, we used our own money to pay for the maintenance costs, but then as the Gota Council to aid Jews gave us money. Finally, do you think your actions during the Holocaust made a big impact on the world? I sure hope so, because we were able to save hundreds of innocent lives. We even received an award in 1965. I can't remember the name of it though. Uh, Riser, what was what was the name of that award your mother and I got? It was the Right Out Among the Nations Award. All right. Well, that's all I wanted to know. Thank you for your actions during the Holocaust, and I appreciate your time. Do you have a loved one that you can't take care of anymore? Well, at Senior Sunrise, we are committed to making sure that your loved one is given the quality care that they deserve. Our hundreds of facilities across the country offer activities such as painting and drawing, card and board games, bingo, and much more. We go on weekly trips to places like the mall and park. Our facilities are also equipped with staff that are dedicated to making sure that your loved ones enjoy living there.